he was I killed you. I remember our battle as clear as day. You remember exactly what I want you to remember. I thought and so. thanks to the orbs of Brock and Drell, your deepest memories will be mine. Blackworm, this does not concern the likes of you. Why, hello and welcome back. Man, is this story ever getting good. And this episode is no exception. It's full of plot twists and turns that'll make your head spin. So enough of this talking stuff, and let's get into it. Into. Why would a Daedric Prince require the aid of sea sloats? The Daedric Princes require minions to carry out their will, and oh. the Slowed have always had an interest in the green and pleasant island. It isn't hard to see why they might work together. For now, you have my thanks for assisting Valserin. Hmm. Well. I asked the Conclave of the Eleven Forces to ponder how we can learn more from the Abyssal Pearl. With the additional information you provided, I expect that Iridel or Amalira will be able to develop a new avenue of investigation now. Iridel or Amarella. You guys got some crazy names. And what more do you hope to learn from the Pearl? The augury ritual revealed the connection to the court of Bedlam and pointed to trouble okay. in Relenthiel. Now we need to determine where Katora and the Sea Sloats are hiding. Okay. The Abyssal Pearl should be able to point us in the right direction. Awesome. How can I help? Meet me in the main gallery. We can consult with the rest of the Conclave and use the scrying pool to continue our probe of the Pearl. <laughs> as much probe as the this pearl. situation concerns me, I must admit, I somewhat enjoy being in the middle of the action again. Hmm. Well, I'll meet you in the gallery. Right, Master. The Abyssal Pearl. It's gone. Oh, jeez. Gone? How? I set the protections personally. See what the scrying pool reveals. There's something happening on the beach. It's the Yagra. They're invading Yagra. Arteum. What? The Pearl. Somehow it was used to summon the Yagra. We need to defend the beach. Okay. Wait. Is that a sword? That would be mine. I'm on my way to help. Eventually. What? The Golden Knight and his sword can wait. The Yagra are our primary concern. The Scrying Pool revealed that Yagra have invaded our island. They must have somehow used the Abyssal Pearl to open a pathway. We need to get down to the beach and repel the invaders. Uh, sounds fun to me. The Sea Sloat have always been envious of Arteum and its secrets. From the beach, they can reach the ruins of the College of Sigix, where we store relics and other items of arcane significance. If the Sea Sloat acquire any of those artifacts... That's a mystery we can solve after we deal with the immediate problem. We need to get down to the beach, destroy the Pearl, and close the Yagra's portal. Will you aid me in these endeavors? <laughs> oh yes, oh yes, for sure. Follow the right master. I'll portal myself and meet you there. Oh, my word. we're gonna go fend off some invaders. Hurry, this way. Before we charge into certain danger, <laughs> you need to know something isn't right. I remember defeating Katora, but somehow the creature and its cabal have returned. And the pearl. I have a vague memory of moving it myself. I am unsettled. Uh-oh. That's thing could... just it. The vague memory. It feels as though it belongs to someone else. Forgive me. We can worry about that later. Now we need to find the Abyssal Pearl and cut off its connection to Arteum. Only then can we stop the flow of Yagra. I feel like this guy's a double agent. Unknowingly or knowingly, one way or another. Very good. After the Pearl is destroyed, we need to search the vaults and make sure none of the creatures breach the defenses. I tried to examine the area through the scrying pool, but something blocked my efforts. Are you ready to proceed? With vanquishing invaders? Yes. Single-handedly repel an alien invasion? Let's go. Destroy it and close that portal. Oh yeah. No problem, bro. Now let's go check on the vaults. 
That was easy. Oh, hey. Haha, destroyed it before you had a chance to show up. To the vaults. Let's have a conversation, bud. These ancient vaults house relics of great power and unusual nature. I sense... Yes, Katora is here. Beyond the sea slot, or one of its agents. I have a strange feeling, so be on your guard. Is there something he's I can think of a number of likely candidates, including a few relics we believe originated in the ancient sea slot kingdom of Ulverkus. Let's get to the central rotunda and begin our search there. <laughs> Show me the way. Fine, I'll I'll go first. I'll go first. Don't worry about it. Ooh, the there's a seal trap. They sealed the chamber. We'll need to go through them. <laughs> Not a problem. That's my specialty. Going through. No problem. The barrier of webs. Burn it away so we can enter the rotunda. Ah, fire. Uh, uh it's my... What? Another Daedric intrusion? My apologies. Daedric interference and Arteum's own defenses delayed my arrival. Mafala's webs? Oh, I hate those things. Allow me. <laughs> uh, Golden Knight. Yes, thank you. Thank you Damn very it. much. You found me again. I'll return when I can. A champion of Meridia? Katora? At least he was helped. I killed you. I remember our battle as clear as day. You remember exactly what I want you to remember. I thought and so. And thanks to the orbs of Brock and Drell, your deepest memories will be mine. Black one, this does not concern the likes of you. Here, what? Quickly. We need to hurry if we're going to help the right master. What? What? It's a good thing I followed you after I alerted the rest of the conclave. I think I can counteract Katura's mind magic, but I'll need your help. Mind magic? Uh, okay. Katura is using the power of the orbs of Barakandrel to enhance his mind magic and what? lock the right master in a mental grip. From what I can discern, the sea slot is flipping through his memories as you or I would turn the pages of a book. Well, that's kind of cool, honestly. An ancient but what are these orbs? Implement, three matched orbs that our relic master believes originated in the Sea of Pearls. We long suspected they were connected to the sea slot. Katora thinks the power of the relic will keep us from interfering. But I have an idea. Ah, so you have a thought. Uh, what do you need me to do? Take this ward key. It will disable the protections on the repositories so you can locate the Ulvor staff and Ulver bring it staff. to me. Got I it. can use the staff to breach the barrier and aid the right master. Just watch out for any lingering <laughs> Yagra. <laughs> yeah, Jairus. <laughs> he could borrow some of mine too, but... Uh... <laughs> I totally agree with that. Uh, if he could survive the cringe, he can have mine. I'll find this staff. Ooh, another big guy. Your mind is my mind, I keep it. Reveal your memories to me. Ah. Uh, a little bit of fire mixed with some daggers. You know. Uh, it's over here. Staff is supposed to be over here. Um, ward key? Relic repository. <laughs> yes, this is what we were after. I got the staff. Uh, shortcut maybe? Yes, we shall enter. Here you go. I got, I got what We're you asked for. We're running out of time. Excellent. And it appears to be in perfect condition. With the staff, I'm certain I can pierce the barrier and open a path to the Mindscape where the Rightmaster struggles against Katora. 
Uh, so we're going in there? Not we. You. Oh, thanks. I need to remain here to anchor you to the physical world. And you're going into Katora's mind. We'll use the connection between them to put you where you can actually hurt the sea slode within its own mindscape. Uh, questions? Katora's mindscape is the perfect place to hurt the sea slode. It's where he's most vulnerable. In a place where thoughts become reality, you'll be able to stop Katora once and for all. Now touch the staff and go save the right master. <clears throat> touch the staff and go save the right master. Got it. Because nothing about that seems creepy. Get it. Touch the Ulvo staff and enter the mindscape. All right. Oh, this is tri trippy. Nice. Oh. Vanquish the guardians to reveal each protected memory. You'll weaken the tour and learn something at the same time. Yeah, those jokes were way too easy. Hi. <laughs> A bargain is a bargain. The island for the heart of transparent law. Yes, yes, just as we agreed. But only a portion of the crystal. We don't want to alert the Sapiarchs too soon. What? Tell your fellow princes all will be well. The right master is no match for my mind magic. So Nocturnal has assured me. Don't disappoint us, Katora. Uh Second memory. Go. Hey, come back here. We're running. You're worth gold. Oh, more. Yes. Stick and move. Stick and move. Oops. Got the stick part right. Forgot the move. I knew you're here for one purpose, worm. Your abyssal cabal may defeat me, but you'll never stand against me. The entire Sigigord. Once again, you fail to grasp the obvious. When the time is right, you will do exactly as I command. Oh, no, Until I won't. Until then, forget. Oh, crazy. That was the third me that was the second memory. Okay. Right on to the third. Is waking up. You need to press on. Vanquish some pearls here. Come on. I see you guys there. Eh. You're not important. Um, there's something creepy and crawly over there. Move along, move along, don't mind me. Who might you be? Ooh. I think I shall call you Toast. Repeat my words, worm. Tell me what you must do. I will. Enter the Crystal Tower. I will take the heart of transparent law. Yes. Yes. Hide it away until I call for you to give it to me. Not even the princes must know where it is. Hide 
the heart. Hide the heart. <coughs> All right, and now we go to the battle. My memory shields. You destroyed them. Yes, I did. Are you going to monologue? Crossing weight of your own insignificance. Yep, you're not going to monologue. We're just going to... Oh, don't! You, you get back here. I'm not done. But in this mindscape, I reign supreme. Um, no. No, you don't. It's shutting down. I'm taking the right master back to his study. You need to get out of there. Use the staff to exit the mindscape. Then talk to Sofa Seal. Uh, I feel like that's not the last we've seen of that guy. Sofa Seal? Oh! A sea slowed. Interesting. I haven't dissected such a specimen in an exceedingly long unit of temporal measurement. What did he just say? Valserin took the right master to Kapora Tower to administer to his wounds. Luckily for you, I arrived in time to help Valserin open a path out of the Slode's dying mine. What did you learn before the mindscape collapsed? Um, uh, well, he made some deals. Yes, I surmised as much. The triad of Daedric Princes has become bold in its attempts to influence Nern, though influence seems to be the least of their goals. The Slode, however, was unable to harvest whatever memory it sought from the right master. Good. I'm glad we stopped it. That revelation disturbs me. I feared the Crystal Tower was too tempting a target for the Daedric Triad. I need to ponder the full implications of their plot. Meanwhile, I suggest you go to Kapura Tower and see how the Right Master is faring. I would agree. Let's go see how he's doing. As you wish, Right Master. I shall travel to Lilandril immediately. Uh, Lilandril? I'll send word to the Eye of the Queen. And you're going to go talk to Raz. Okay. I owe you a debt of gratitude, friend of Valserin. What the two of you did to help me, that was a step beyond. Thank you. And it seems you accomplished what I failed to do. You ended the threat of Katora. Ah, Bashida. Got it. Yeah. <laughs> I understand now, Jairus. Katora tricked me in the past. Made he me did remember trick you. a victory I never won. Ah. Then he planted a compulsion, forced me to steal the heart of transparent law from the crystal tower. Apparently I hid it and forgot about it. Ah. He sought that memory. What is this? The crystal tower of this? stands as a mystical protection for Somerset. Transparent law, a crystal at the top of the tower, serves as its source of power. With the heart removed from the crystal, the protection provided by the tower slowly weakens. Hmm. So the heart is part of a larger crystal? Yes. A smaller gem that had been embedded in the larger crystal. If the Daedric princes acquire the heart, they could take control of the crystal tower. What? Valserin and Oriandra will warn Somerset, while I try to remember where I hid the heart. You helped me remember my true encounter with Katora and his Abyssal Cabal. I remember how they defeated me 300 years ago, compelled me to do their bidding, made me forget. For now, I need solitude to seek the memories that still elude me. I feel like he just said he's going to go sulk. Perhaps the Sigic Sages can help me remember where I hid the heart of transparent law. At least you stopped Katora before the sea slow gained that knowledge. Yeah. In the meantime, we must warn the Sapiarchs of the threat to the Crystal Tower. What? What, what the Sapiarchs? Who are these guys? Well, hey, thanks for hanging out with me. I really appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. We'll see you next time.